I'm Kurt with Infinity Cutting Tools, and today I want to talk with you about the Lignomat Mini Ligno ED Moisture Meter. This pin style moisture meter is very, very accurate and extremely easy to use. Now you're going to ask, why do I need the moisture meter? And the answer is, have you ever had a panel shrink or expand and break a door or rattle too much in the door? Have you had a piece of furniture that gets warped or bowed? Um, drawers that no longer open and close because they've swelled and expanded too much. And that right there is why you need the moisture meter. The moisture meter gives us the moisture content of the wood and that allows us to compare it to what the equili equilibrium moisture content in our shop is. Um, and what we need is that the equilibrium moisture content of our shop or the furniture's final destination would be an even better moisture content. Um, we need those to be very, very similar because if they're similar, then there's not going to be as much movement. Um, obviously, we still got seasonal changes. We've got you know different things that can affect it, but this is going to really help us narrow it down so that there's less problems. Um, and typically, the e EMC or the equilibrium moisture content that we're looking for in most shops in the United States is going to be in the six to eight percent. But down here in the southeast, we can go up you know up in the 11s to 15 percent even. So a lot just depends on the area you're in and you'll need to figure out what your EMC is year round and what your averages are gonna be and that's gonna really help. The other thing is let your wood acclimate to your shop. And if you let your wood acclimate to your shop for a good period of time, you're gonna have less problems. So let me go over all the details and functions of this and show you how it works. The Lignomat Mini Ligno ED Moisture Meter is one of the best pin type moisture meters on the market. With its bright LED display, built-in correction for two wood groups, automatic shutoff, two different size pins for measuring different depths, and a wide measuring range of 6% to 45% on the wood scale, the Mini Ligno ED is a perfect tool for making sure your lumber has the perfect equalized moisture content to your shop. It comes in a great carry case that includes a handy reference guide to tell you which wood group your lumber belongs in. To use the Mini Ligno ED moisture meter, Simply depress the center button that's between the two pins twice, and that'll turn it on. And then you simply press it to toggle back and forth between the two wood groups. Now, we're gonna do walnut, which is gonna be in wood group three. We can see that on our little handy reference guide. So, we've got it toggled to three. Now, putting it into the end grain, so fresh cut end grain is gonna give you your best reading. Oh, I don't know if you can see that, there we go and that tells us basically where we're at and it should equalize after a few minutes it may go back and forth a little bit but then it should basically equalize out and we're at 7.6 and that's what our moisture content is going to be on this piece of walnut so as you can see it's as simple as that now one of the nice things that i really like about the mini ligno is its little case so it comes with this little hard shell cap that you can then put on and that gives you a nice little handle as you can see, so it really helps when you're pushing it into some material, especially harder stuff, you can kind of get behind it. The other nice feature on it is that if you open this up and pull this apart, two extra pins are in there. So these are little 3 16 pins, for which will do you for most of the wood you're using, but inside there's some 7 16 pins, which will help you get to some bigger, thicker pieces of wood and give you a really nice readout for it. So you can see how easy it is to use the Lignomat Mini Ligno ED Moisture Meter. It's a very easy process. Now, the next step in the process is to figure out the EMC in your shop or home. And so, I'm using a cheap little indoor thermometer with a hygrometer built into it. I think this was eight or nine dollars. Um, and it's got a little magnet on the back and just, I'll stick it to wherever I can to give me that temperature and that indoor humidity. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna use those two measurements, indoor humidity and temperature, and we're gonna compare them onto a chart or one of the calculators that's available on the internet. Uh, tons of these out there, so just find one that you like. And we'll plug those in and that's gonna give us the EMC that we're going for. And then we'll just use that EMC to measure with the Lignomat's moisture meter readout and that's gonna tell us where we need to be. Um, and you're gonna to wanna to give yourself some fluctuation in that. Um, and so basically you'll do your math for you know, shrinkage and things like that based off of what you're getting and what time of season it is. Like right now it's winter time for us here in, uh, in Florida and so it's a little bit colder and, so we're, and it's not as humid right now. So we're at our you know, 
smallest, uh, where the wood pieces are going to be the smallest. But during summertime, our wood is going to get full of moisture and expand out. So I hope that helps and shows you why you need a moisture meter.